contest is a professional lightweight bout. Introducing first, fighting out of the Agoji Blue Corner, representing Rufus Sport. Entering tonight with an 0-1 record from Chicago, Illinois. Weighing in at 151.1 pounds, Memnon Warrior, Emmanuel Pugh! Laser focus is Pugh. <laughs> His opponent, fighting out of the Modelo Red Corner, representing ATT Sunrise, from Sunrise, Florida. Entering tonight with an 0-1 record, weighing in at 155.9 pounds, Ryan the Lion Schwartzberg! As Ryan the Lion this has been a part by of EAFL promoted fights before, part of the M1 Global USA crossover back in January of 2020. That was his last bout as an amateur. And Schwartzberg here. Set to lock it up with Emmanuel Q. Three five-minute rounds of action. Our third to final bout of the night. Let's get things started. It's all about this cage control. And Schwarzberg does have a three-inch height advantage here and an age advantage. But Emmanuel Pew, again, you could put him in there with the best of the best, and he will not back down. You know, already in up on that takedown. Schwarzberg did a good job of controlling that head right off the bat, but then went to it to do some strikes. Nice takedown by Pew. Right into the guard right there. And I'll tell you what, Emmanuel Pugh coming into this one pretty game. And Ryan Schwartzberg, again, after three straight pro boxing fights, Frankie, how do you adjust back to get into the cage? Practice. <laughs> get your butt back to practice. And this certainly could be an adjustment period right here. And I don't know how much really room you have to give with Emmanuel Pugh as your opponent. Yeah, you know, I mean, he, I mean, he got back up to his feet here pretty easy. Nice job getting back to the stand-up, as you pointed out there, Frankie, as Emmanuel Pugh has been on the offensive attack throughout the first minute or so of this fight. But Ryan the Lion Schwartzberg going to try to recover right here. As he does have the reach advantage over Emmanuel Pugh. Let's see if he can utilize that and find an opening. Gee, Schwartzberg's got to close that distance, make it a boxing match. And if this does become a boxing match, despite Emmanuel Pugh having boxing experience in his own right, you have to believe that advantage sides with the Lion Schwartzberg. Yeah, you know, and it just comes down to just controlling that distance. Don't let him get in that kick distance, but just right there in that punch range. Caught him with an uppercut right there. And catches the Pugh, Pugh's... Oh, he's rocked against the cage! And that looks to be a wrap as Ryan the Lion Schwartzberg finishes it off in round number one and picks up the... Let him get in that kick distance, but just right there in that punch range. Caught him with an uppercut right there. And catches the Pew Pew's. Oh, he's rocked against the cage. And that looks to be a wrap as Ryan the Lion Schwartzberg finishes it off in round number one and picks up the first goal of his professional career. Schwartzberg caught him. Came in, started swinging like right into that boxing range like we were just talking about. And Pugh had, Pugh had no answer for it. A series of jabs and uppercuts, and Ryan the Lion utilizes the boxing to his advantage. And Emmanuel Pugh unable to recover. Big win for Ryan the Lion here tonight in Gary. I didn't see the decision going that way, to be honest. Not this early. Not this I early. I certainly thought things would play out at least into the second or even third round. Thought we might even go the distance with this one. But both men brought the fireworks. Q unable to get the job done. And Ryan Schwartzberg going to bring a home win back oh, home to God. South Florida. Oh, glory to God, Representing man. American all the way down top to South Florida. Top fighting camps. I want to rep ATT Sunrise. As soon as Q came Walk in and, and really closed the distance belt. and got on those legs and took uh, them down, I'm like, oh, it's going to be a I long night. Ball, They're just going right Burns. there. Renee Robert, the man I've had a chance to call. He's got his fights down the state of Florida as well. Hey, guys. Well here tonight. Ryan the Lion and David Schwartzberg. Ryan Schwartzberg and David Schwartzberg. In the, the state of Indiana. Awesome.